Okay, today I'm going to go over how to calculate the totals for the different wings that we have tested during class. And I'm going to start with calculating the average. So to begin to begin with, let's just have a quick review. So far we have uh, calculated the average for each flight. So each row represents a wing and we threw it 10 times and we uh, collected the data. And now what we're going to do is we're going to input that data or actually we're going to calculate the total of all of the data for the delta wing. Because we have calculated each row and we have a few differences, you can see from 333 to 334, we're going to need to calculate the grand total for delta. So to do that, we're going to put our cursor in O36. You can see this is column O and it's row 36. And I'm going to type in the equal sign and then AV. I'm going to select average. And now I'm going to click my last average, which was here in flight 10. Yeah, this is flight 10. And it is in row 335. So from column in 335, I'm going to left click, hold down my click without letting go. I'm going to go up to column E, row 320, which is the first flight in flight one. Now you can see I have a selection box around all of my data. Notice I did not include the average column. And once we have it selected, I'm going to go ahead and just press the enter key. And now you can see we have calculated the average for our delta wing totals. The next thing that <clears throat> I'm going to do is calculate it for my elliptical wing. So we're going to use the same process. We click in this cell next to elliptical wing totals. We type in equals AV, select average, and then we click our very last flight and we scroll up without unclicking. So that was a left click. I'm holding down my click. I can select all of the data that I need. I let go once I have it all selected and I press the enter key on my keyboard. And when I do that, now I have a grand total average for all of the wing types. And we're going to come down and we're going to do the same thing for the straight wing totals. So I click on straight wing totals, I select equals, and I type in AV, click on average, select my last flight, and I scroll up, and there it is. Let go, I press the enter key, I have my straight wing totals, and the last one, we click, equals AV, select average, I left click my last flight, scroll up to the first flight, all of my flights are selected, I press the enter key, we have calculated the average for all of our wing types. And now we can look and we can clearly see, hey, the delta wing, 23.7 on average, the elliptical wing 25.3 on average and <clears throat> the straight wing 23.9 on average. So it's pretty easy to see that uh, the elliptical wing totals are actually